Well, good day, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide, and we are on September 21st, 2018, the last day of summer. Welcome to fall tomorrow, first day of fall. Thank you for joining me today. We're going to start off with a look at the Pacific Disaster Center, showing all the latest disasters from fires, floods, droughts, hurricanes, every disaster that you can think of is listed here. And we still have fires, forest fires in parts of Northern Ontario and Idaho, floods in Ohio, and of course, South Carolina, flooding conditions throughout Mexico, South Texas, storms here in Bolivia, all the fires in Africa, wind and rain event throughout parts of the United Kingdom. And of course, these Tropical Storm 4, who is down, who is man cut over China and floods throughout China as man cut ripped through. And now we have the next tropical storm in line, Trammy. And we're just gonna get a quick view from NASA Worldview of our planet right now, looking at some pretty large low pressure systems spinning. Looking at this one over Eastern Russia. And this one here off of Kamchatka. And then this very large low over parts of Western Russia. Keeping an eye on this situation because these low pressure vortices are getting stronger and bigger. Looking at, I mean, this looks like a tropical storm from above hitting the United Kingdom right now. Very organized low pressure center. Spinning counterclockwise. We also have here tropical storm development an area of interest for now but most likely will be a another Atlantic hurricane forming but it also depends on how it interacts with all of this dust from the Saharan dust storm it could be bad for it it could be good for it we don't know we'll have to see in the coming days Impressive low pressure center here in the Southern Hemisphere. Very vigorous and busy Southern Hemisphere compared to the Northern. And here's the latest look at Tropical Storm Trammy. I wanna thank you all for joining me today Staying aware and prepared with Morning Dew daily events worldwide. We're going to get into a five day forecast here and the forecast track for Tropical Storm Trammy is a northwest track heading towards Taiwan and Japan. But looking at this storm, it's going to be a very strong storm. Look at how perfect that circle is. by the time it hits Japan. So a projected forecast is a category four storm. Heading straight to Taiwan and Japan. So stay aware and prepared in Japan, friends and family from across the world, looking at another large low pressure system heading north of Hawaii. That'll be an impressive winter maker once it hits the BC coastline next week. So yeah, weather network forecasting four centimeters of snow here in Calgary. I, don't, I definitely don't think we'll be getting that. We'll get maybe a trace, a centimeter or two. Most of the system stayed north of us, but man, we did get those cold temps Across the nation right now, Canada is feeling winter. And we're not even on the first day of fall. That is tomorrow. So, 
Welcome to fall, everybody. Bye-bye, summer. Hope you enjoyed it. So, yeah, situation happening in Quebec. A lot of snow over the next few days. And here is the developing low-pressure center off of Africa. Doesn't show any development here on the five-day forecast. So that's why I'm saying don't really know what this Sahara dust storm is going to do to the storm, right? whether it'll break it down or intensify it. So later this week, watch for a large low pressure center moving through eastern parts of Europe and into Russia. So look for a large wind and rain event throughout these areas. And of course, we're looking at this situation in South China. Cold temps in Russia, very cold. So yeah, the situation with Mankut, the storm track has moved a little bit more west than the forecast that I gave yesterday. So quite not quite Nepal, but northern parts of India, southern Mongolia, will be getting, as I said, three meters of snow. I'll show you guys in my next video the 10-day trend for the northern hemisphere for snow. Looking around the world right now, large low-pressure center south of New Zealand. Large low-pressure center, Buenos Aires bringing thunderstorms and then yeah low pressure after low pressure system down in the south hammering South Sandwich Islands atmospheric compression earthquakes will happen Speaking of earthquakes, we're going to get into that right now. Let's look at our last 24 hours for earthquakes. Somewhat of a forecasted area, South America, uh, the Galapagos Islands, popped off a 5.7 early this morning. And then we had very deep earthquakes, 5.9 at a 640 kilometer depth in Fiji. Another one before that. 534 kilometer depth a lot of very deep earthquakes recently it's a little bit concerning I've never seen so many deep earthquakes on the earthquake map in my you know three to four years of constantly studying earthquake data every day so 5.7 at a 10 kilometer depth larger shallow earthquake after deeper earthquakes looking at the last seven days very busy for earthquakes. Most recent action has been the busiest. So stay aware and prepared folks. Have a plan, a couple weeks worth of food and water. Always be prepared for any type of disaster or severe weather event. I want to thank you for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.